San Bonandi Malang Abu Sheni. Hello, it's Mosa back with Pop House Entertainment. And I've got something really special for you. Look, Kekate is like you live. You know, you watch our lives on Instagram and you love them, right? But I thought, I want to be here in the flesh. I want to have some. Um, and, wow. a, 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 a and a young you know number I mean? who's a higher have some fun Hi, you know? so I thought you know <laughs> let me just start it with a bang with a, a huge life and someone that is larger than life Hi. you know just how we do it here Hi. on Pop Pulse <laughs> I have Denise Zimmer with me hello girl how you doing how are you Musa thank you Luana I think the first thing I said when I saw you was Girl, those pictures don't do you no justice. Well, thank you. Well, Cheers. Cheers to that. <laughs> no, that was Hi, like everyone. an ad. Hi, that everyone. Was like an ad. That was like, <laughs> yeah. 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 Right yeah. Right yeah. It's so nice to be here with you. Thank, thank you so you. much for inviting me. Thank you for um, being here. And uh, yeah, no, you look amazing. Thank and you. It's you so too. Nice to see you. So. You know, I thought, and, I, and and this is what I was telling my producer, that it's it's really a big start. I mean, starting with you, because, mm. I mean, your entire career was documented. And uh, yeah. you didn't start there. I think you started very young. And very I think young. That's where we need to take it to, yeah. um, to get to know Denise. We need to go back a mm -hmm. couple of years. Uh, you're a triple threat, and you're from the Northwest. So, Northwest, stand up, stand up, stand up. Uh, me and you, I mean, you I mean, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, when did it start? When did the bug bite you? You were a triple threat, which is wow. a huge thing. Bug bit me when I was like, I think about seven, eight, I was watching a video by Aaliyah and I was like, I don't know what that is, but that's my vibe. Mm. And it just grew on me. My sister was very much into like hip hop and R&B at the mm. time. My older sister was seven years gap and she kind of like gave me that influence of listening to different kind of music. Mm. And from there it just grew. Then it was a Brandy, then it was Brenda, then it was Level, then it was just like, and from there I just knew I wanted to be on stage. Mm. How it looked like, how it would happen, I don't know. Um, fast forward, um, started doing talent shows in high school. Yeah. And at the same time, I was like actually really like bad struggling at school with my grades because I was um, doing hockey and I thought I was going to go pro hockey, field hockey. Mm. And my mom was like, you have to decide. Is it going to be the school plays or are you going to be doing field hockey because your grades are going bad. Yeah. And somewhere along the line, I chose entertainment, got into musical theater, did that. Wow. Um, Went into the industries, started being like a go-go dancer at Vaga Girls in Monte Cassino, yeah. Kuntari. Um, and then it was Fly Chicks, and then it was Vuzu, and then it was Generations, and then the rest is just history. And, and then you just came, and then you just, yeah, yeah. then you just, then yeah. booked and busy. Booked, booked and busy. busy. <laughs> booked and busy. <laughs> I'm gonna steal that one. <laughs> Book them busy. Book them busy. <laughs> Book them, uh, book them busy, hun. Um, you know, and, and we know your career. And yeah. uh, look, we all loved you. We loved Denise. Thank you. And I think everybody uh, was like, where's Denise? Where's Denise? Because I think there was there was an Instagram live that I had watched of yours. You mm -hmm. were very vocal about your your journey and yeah. being a mother yeah. and, and what it took. Yeah. Um, where did you disappear to? Because we thought, you know, maybe you would document that entire yeah. um, experience. So for me, being in the industry at the time that I was in, and people always thought I was crazy because I was the height of my career and somehow just decided to just give it all up. Mm. But one thing I realized is that the environment of the industry sometimes can be very, you know, deceiving. Mm. And there's a whole lot of politics and things that go behind the scenes that people don't see, especially when you're a black female. Mm. And uh, I found myself in a position where I was just like becoming an angry black woman because of the way I was treated yeah. and the way I was shifted from one place to yeah. another. Work hard, but you don't, or you don't earn much. Yes. And I mean, work, 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 we'll pay you. And then the pay doesn't come after like six months, yeah. you know? And I just started getting really angry and I was projecting an energy that didn't really mm define who I really was. was and I knew I had a conversation with my dad and he was like if you want to leave the industry or pull away or take a break do it in a time at your highest level so people don't forget who the fuck you are yeah can I say and that? Lebron, that's exactly what you did no 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 yeah you're, you're safe. and you're so safe. I was you're like safe. yeah all right so I was like my pop said I'm you know I must remind people who the fuck I am you and know what I mean and then I pulled back because I knew I was I mean, you could see past tweets were just like, I was always angry, attacking yeah. other females. I was just mm. like complaining about every little thing that I mm. thought shoulda, coulda, woulda. Mm. And something inside just said, you need to take a step back, center yourself, redirect, re reshuffle, reflect, regenerate. Mm. And 
and that's what I did. I just, I mean, it was crazy at the time because everybody's like, where are you going? You're just there. You just hit the top. Yeah. And what is the top if you're unhappy, right? I mean, what's the top? Exactly. If you can't get out of being just enjoying this that person space. that yeah. is in entertainment and yeah. being a mother and that's it. Yeah. I think it's healthy to be Denise in entertainment, Denise as a mom, yeah. Denise as this and yeah. that. I don't blame you, girl. And I yeah. think I think you came back with a massive bag. And and you came back I think for me personally, looking at your Instagram, I saw a video with you and 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 your child and, and you guys are just, you know, playing and that is so beautiful to yeah. see. How has the journey of motherhood been for you? Jeez. I mean, you can never be prepared. Happy Denise, because this is who we Listen, see Listen, you can never be prepared. Like, as soon as I left the industry, luckily I had a great support system family-wise. I found an amazing partner who is now my husband and, and mm. the father of my child. And um, blessing that he lived in Germany. So when I broke away, I could go into that space somewhere, different country, different language, different space, different environment to recollect myself. Mm. In that process, we got married. In that process, we had Leah. But one thing I can say is you can never be prepared for motherhood. You can never be prepared for parenthood. <laughs> okay. I don't give a damn how many books you've read. Okay. <laughs> Let me tell you something. It can never happen. <laughs> it's just like, it's just, you know, when you become a first time mom, you actually, your old self is shit. It's like, you know, you become a new person. And then you have to define that person and get to know that person. Yes. So, I mean, my body changed, my mental state changed, the way I saw things, life, feelings, experiences was all different. Yeah. Then I had the responsibility of this human being. Yeah. And I just thought to myself, I have to take the time to just figure this thing out. Yeah. Once I get a flow, I can get back into the industry. Mm. And that's where I'm at now. I've Two been... years later, by the way, and I'm still trying to figure it out. And no, 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 and I want to get into it. I want to get into your music. And yeah. I feel as though, um, I'll, get, I'll get into that in, in concluding our chat. I yeah. think the most important part of this is is figuring out how you have navigated, yeah. you know, growing Denise and and moving from yeah. who you thought you were to yeah. actually creating yourself. And you know, a lot of exactly. females think Good point. you become, you know, you you become this amazing person, but you actually create this amazing person. You have and you to stay yeah. this amazing person. But speaking about amazing people, you mentioned something really special, and you said, you know, you're now married and you have a child mm -hmm. together. How did you know your husband was the one? Jeez, how did I know he was the one? I, I, typical Denise, wilding out. I don't know what the hell I was doing. I was, I grabbed him in the middle of nowhere and I just, I kissed him. I was like, I just went through a bad breakup and you're the only guy who's available. So today I'm just gonna kiss you and then we'll see what happens. And that's literally what happened. And he was shocked. And then I think I, I, I went to, it was a party. There was something going on. I jumped in the pool. I like this I, And then I like, I'm, and then I left I'm, him. It was like a Cinderella thing. It was just mm. like, Kiss Looking goodbye, for the lost the slipper mm. in the pool. God, mm. that's mm. 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 And then are you the one? And then the about next it. day, about it. You know what? About it. Fits. One, yeah, one confuser, about it, it fits. About it. My prince. One. About it. Uh huh. Many. About it. About it. What about? <laughs> <laughs> and I kid you not, it sounds nuts, but that's what happened. Wow. Everything just happened so quick. Wow. But the one thing I love about him is that he's a generous person mm -hmm. and is always encouraging me to be my best self. Mm -hmm. And by any means necessary, if it means he has to give up something for me to fly and flourish, mm -hmm. he would do that. And as soon as I gave, gave the time to, to get married and have a baby, he was just like loyal to the core. Mm -hmm. And that's what I love about him. He allows me to be who I want to be and doesn't want to fix me or change me mm. and is only there to support me. I love that. I and when it gets that. hard, he's the one who's like, you're going nowhere. This yeah. is what it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Life, this there's is what these you need. challenges. This is what you need. Mm. And I can imagine he has, because you, you've you got this personality that's larger than life. And, and he's, he's completely like, different. Yeah, he's like the guy that like brings you. Completely Don't you need different. that? Do we all You that? all need an opposite. Do I think we need that? It's, it's, you need the chaos to keep the relationship going. Mm. Life can't be a comfort mm. because you don't grow you don't get enlightened you don't become your truest potential I know through failure is, you grow yeah through challenges you evolve mm. and I love that about our relationship because we are so opposite when I mean black and white when I mean yin and yang when I mean, yeah, I mean Tom and Jerry when I mean 
Pinky and the Brain. When I mean, yes, you know, <laughs> I, I don't know, Michael Jackson Prince. You know, it's it's no. literally that. Look, and I and I can imagine. If this was alive, we'd have these questions coming up and people will actually slaughter me if I don't ask you this question. Do you still get those DMs even after you're married? Even after you've got a child? Yeah. No? Even after... What? I got Why shocked Lilisa? by... Can, Why I just, can I just say, I get so shocked by some of some of these rappers. Oh. Even after those I have a baby. <laughs> that oh also my. have babies. Oh, oh, I mean, That's I mean, still... Oh, 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 oh. I, 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 but no, do you blame them? <laughs> no, Mara, do you blame them? Uh, the hockey uh, body doesn't uh, want to go. Uh, Mara, Mara, the, the, the hockey body like, does not want to go. You know, I'm, I no, mean, but I'm, you know that's the bikes I'm, I'm serious. I'm mm. serious. I'm serious, guys. I'm just, I'm not calling out any names, okay? No, no, no. We Look, I'm squatting. This. I'm not calling out any names. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. We all have kids. Let's just worry about our, our children. And our marriages. And, then let's, and our marriages. And then let's just like do music, okay? <laughs> and, and let's just work. All we need to do is just work together and support yeah. each other. Guys, you heard That's all I gotta Papa. say. You okay? heard it. You heard on Papa. So that's Arikini what I get shocked respect. by. Like some of these dudes, I'm like, mm. And Elena, can I, are you not married? Mar and I know your baby mom. And I don't, I don't know. What are we doing? And then sometimes that's when I was like, babe, can we just go to Germany just to take a break? Because mm. South Africa's a lot. <laughs> no, and, uh, and, and I can imagine. Look, and, and, and I need to say this. I, I don't blame you. Look, I don't blame you for DMing still. The hockey body is still there, as you can see. Even after a baby, you ask yourself, where did the baby come out of? Mara, she's Nothing just saying uh, that she's saying kupali, <laughs> <laughs> respecting manyalo avatubaba. Hey, because who awkward? And then I'm going to be like, 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 now everything's awkward. Why, and I just want a, a, a hit record. With a feature, Robin, but now you're asking too much feature. Speaking about a hit, uh, a hit record, yes, uh, you've got uh, Tobella out, yay! And it's 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 your breakout jam. I'm calling it a breakout jam. Thank from, you. You know everything that you you that have I've done, you've done different, you know, differently, different and approach. This is, I mean, yeah. new Denise, yeah, coming right back mm. into the industry at your top spot where you belong. Thank um, you. You've always been so a girl. Kind. You've always been a girl that shares the the throne. You you share it with your other sisters. We know from Fly Chicks, we've Thank seen you. your reality shows, and you know I think we need to give it to you. You need to smell these roses while you're Thank still you. alive. And the song Wayen Kachum. Okay. Mm. okay. Mm. Yeah. No, I'm, Smelling the roses, mm, and while you deserve you still one can. too. Yes, you deserve baby. one too. Thank you. <laughs> so I mean, let's talk about that. Where, because Tobela in Sipedi is hello, mm. and that to me as an introduction. I mean, you say exactly. hello when you meet somebody else. Exactly. And I feel as though you're reintroducing yourself. Exactly. Like, talk us through the song. You're and spot on. on. It's just because being away in the high height has been away for so long. Um, it's just kind of saying, hey guys, I'm still here, still the same, still wild, still crazy, still got a lot to say, still want to contribute to the industry. Mm. Um, so, hello, Tobelang. Dibelang. But, but also, what's also nice what's about good? that is that uh, Lebu Matosa, which a lot of people could uh, compare you to, she has oh, a wow. song called Tobela. Yes, of and course. And she was... Uh, and a, a firecracker like yeah. yourself. I mean, I was I was very young uh, during the love, love. in the industry. But I mean, you know, a lot of people could say that you remind them of Lebu Matosa. And oh, then wow. you come up with this song. Oh, wow. Tobela, and they're like... I don't even know if I'm allowed no. to, to like take that. Jeez, that's like... No. Wow. Absolutely. That's, that's amazing. I've always should. loved Lebu Matosa. I've mm. always loved what she stood for, being different. Um, just creating a different kind of experience in the entertainment industry, you know with her loss that there's something missing. Mm -hmm. And that's how I was, I've always believed my my stance being a person in the industry mm -hmm. to to create conversation, absolutely, be that difference, mm -hmm. be that 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 different texture, that that textile that just adds to the growth mm -hmm. of our industry. Allow women to be able to like express themselves mm. at their highest potential without mm. being ridiculed because we're women or we're yeah. black or whatever the case may be. And w for you to say that, I mean, or for anybody else, geez, I don't even know how to take that, but thank you no, if that's the case. I mean, no, it really is. And I, I need a, I need a really sip <laughs> for that. <laughs> wow. But may her Rada soul rise in peace. She's more. amazing. Oh my God, that's a no, big one. Is, but no, thank she's you. She's amazing, and you're yeah. amazing. And we thank need you. To tell you. Thank you, Musa. And um, look, the song in itself, I think, is is you opening this chapter. Mm. So this chapter, what does it entail? Ah, just 
I wanted to get back into the music because I feel like music is a space where you're able to narrate your true self and be a storyteller. I've always been a storyteller. Studying musical theatre, you go into the form of directing, writing scripts, breaking down scripts, um, and also just being able to perform in a, with a live audience. There's nothing like experiencing people experiencing your journey and seeing them take it in and being able to reflect within their own lives. And that for me is everything. And I just, I just want to perform. I just want to sing. I want to, I want to be on stage. I want to, I want to tell my truth. And I, I'm, I, I think I would like to think that people who know me experience me to just call a thing a thing and tell my truth, and tell truth that people don't want to say. And music also allows that. Yeah. So will we see you back on the screens? I mean, if it's a good contract, we, we, we can we can we can Ladut. negotiate, we can Ladut. discuss. Ladutra. And please, we and can do let the it most be a good, together. A good contract. Uh, Any uh -huh. up and coming features that you are looking forward to? I can't say right now because uh, come on, uh, come fun. on, come on. Okay, well, give us one because this is an exclusive. I can't. Interview. But we're giving you an exclusive. Even the gentleman right now on the set, I would say, but I can't. Oh. There's a guy right oh. on the set that we're doing a few. I cannot. What? You, it just it spoils the fun. Really it tried. spoils the magic. Guys, I really, the magic, I really, guys. really tried, really tried. I mean, that, as Beyonce say, yo, guys, my next album. Mara, mara, it's over. Bye, it's over. It's over. No, no. About the one when Drake that or Kanye have. West or even Casper or AK, do they go? And my feature is gonna one be feature. Mara, 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 one feature. Mara, one. Let Boydi. Does she tell you feature? Yeah, get over. Mara, we'll tell you about Boydi. Maybe she can. Maybe Boydi. Maybe I can. I, I mean, Twitter. I would love, I would Maybe love to I'll feature Twitter. with Boiti. For me, what I respect about her is that she grinds and she does what she feels like she can can do, and she does it at the best level, of like interna international. Yeah, you can't take that away from her. Absolutely not. So, Boiti, get on phone now. I know how Oh, you bad. You better Arabe because then we need that. We need, oh. we need these females to come together. Literally, Nadia, stay rouge. Waban, Larie. Let's Gigi start La Main. Gigi. 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 Huh? Gigi. Rouge. Gigi. Boit. Nadia. It sounds like a freaking... No muesli. Doesn't it huh? sound like a salad? No, it really Like does. a French salad. <laughs> Gigi. Gigi. Rouge. It does. Mousse. No, it does. Nadia. I mean. Boit. Hello. It's my then, then Denise kiss salad dressing. I, I mean, because no, it doesn't. In Ali, the sauce. I can only this. Sauce. Yeah, okay, maybe. But can we? Oh, I, gotta, I might just have work? to change my name. Uh, guys, Denise is a lot, eh? So before we wrap it up, I need to make sure that I get the <laughs> important questions quickly. Quick one. Yes. Are we gonna, can we expect a body of work from you? Absolutely. Big project needs to come. Music is my main focus. I mean, I'm with a new team right now, so we're just trying to work out is it EP, is it album? I'm a storyteller. I believe, like, if you're gonna write a book, write a full book and then go on into the next book. No right chapters. But that's just me. And But again, you know, there's always logistics to music. Mm. Who's willing to show up and, mm. you know, what would make sense at the moment. At the time, might be an EP, might be an album. Mm. Who knows? Look, I could we be here know. with you forever, but a quick question, because I can already see my director and all of them saying, guys, we can't afford having Denise here. Yeah, we're having so much fun. Yeah. But now she's going to start <laughs> billing us. So I need to make sure that I get the last question out, baby. It's uh -oh. been so much fun hanging out with you. Thank you. But uh, just to wrap it up, I mm. think it's really important what you've mentioned about girls keeping together, about mm. the journey that you've been through, mm. about how females are treated in the industry. Mm. And it really is important mm. for girls like you uh, to speak to these young girls yeah. that are thinking to come into the industry. Yeah. These young girls that look up to you and yeah. have not stopped because you have a baby, yeah. have not stopped because you're married. Uh, you know, young girls that think you need to sleep your way to the top. Mm. Young girls that don't understand how, her, how hard mm. you work. That even um, gave me the chills. You know what I mean? Yeah. So do you have anything to say to that camera or that camera? To um, I'll, I'll, into I'll speak industry. to both. But for me, what I can say, what I've learned, especially having a daughter myself, is that I used to be that girl that used to be so frustrated in my environment that I would pick on other girls to make me feel better, whether it was fair or not. Probably not fair. Mm. So I can take accountability for that. Mm. Second of all, it then with that point being said, it is so important to be able to unite in any situation, in any way you want to find success and be victorious is we need each other to work, to make things work, to have things grow. Mm. And that's just on a humanitarian perspective, level. level. Yeah. So yes, young girl, don't compromise who you are. Young girl, follow through. It's gonna be hard. Life is hard for anybody. Push through, stay true to who you are, Keep your integrity intact. 
and you know play the game a kiki kaka doesn't help but you don't have to kiki kaka you know what i mean mm. so just <laughs> so there's a difference no over. I love it. It was right. so amazing being with you. Let me say bye to our people before I say bye to you. It's been amazing hanging out with Denise Zimba. We're on that camera, baby girl. It's been amazing hanging out with Denise. Kubi to kopan. Kopan pizza kopan. No, because we're not so high. It was so nice hanging out with you. Okay. So we're not going to talk about it. It was so amazing hanging out with you, Kaya. Thank you so much for joining us. I will be back again with another exclusive interview. But we thought, hey, let's. Started up with a big bang and we did that. So thanks for joining us. And I'm gonna finish my glass of wine with Denise. And, and I can I just say you are freaking amazing. Thank you. You too. Oh, Musa. You too. No, if you were if okay. you were there when I started, I would be stressed. <laughs> Girl. I'm like, then I'll have to really talk like this. And my throat, I can't keep up. And no, I wanna ache you God given to me. And I ache God given to me. And I hate for a step. This is where you roll the credits. No, seriously. Thank you very much. No, I'm not kidding. Cheers to you. Like, like. Cheers, baby. Thank you.